Each one of you guys matters. You operate as a team, you function as a team, you believe in your brotherhood. If you're not willing to give everybody 100% of your effort, then why are you here? There's an expectation from us of you. There's an expectation of you of us. We are not going to let you down and we're not going to let you let us down. While you're here, you will pull, you will push, you will drive, you will motivate each other. You're going to be the best that you possibly can be, and if that's not good enough, you're going to give it to us anyway. You can ring the bell and the victory together at the end of this, or you can ring along by yourselves and defeat. You know, one of the things we want them to do is, is learn how to get comfortable being uncomfortable. And I think right now they're fairly uncomfortable. I think they're confused, rattled a little bit. I think they're tired. Uh, you know, they're being forced right now by Rob to listen closely, to act quickly, to act as a team. And uh, right now they're struggling a little bit. So I expect it to get better. We got off the bus and it was pretty hectic. Uh, a lot of voices, a lot of things going on, but uh, I think we handled it pretty well emphasis that you put on brotherhood we're gonna learn what it really is like to be a brotherhood here uh, I think right now we're just a team we have a lot of untapped potential and we're not sure how good we can be but we're gonna learn real quick here I think if I had to pinpoint one activity, it was it was taking the boats out through the waves. You know, that just required real teamwork. I think it required some courage of some guys that aren't used to being in that situation. Just, just being here with my team is the only thing that's really getting me through this, just fighting together, uh, hurting together, going through this pain and diversity together. In this type of environment, you have to be able to depend on on your teammates for, for, for everything, you know, it's, it's survival. You get to show the guys that they can really count on you. You know, we're just getting through it together. It's tough, it's grinding, it's grueling, no sleep, but it's a humbling experience and it's a learning experience and something you'll take from you for the rest of your life. And what I see is every time we, we create a competition for them, they spike. And uh, I think you'll continue to see that.
it's so important when you're a football team that you act as a team and a process that has to take place in order for you to become a team. You can be a collection of really great players, but to be a great team takes something special. It takes a bond, I think a shared experience. It's been something that uh, these kids will remember forever. I think it has lasting impressions on them. Uh, I think it has immediate, will have an immediate impact on us as a football team. Uh, just learning about the men that you're depending on and they're depending on you, I just think it's critical. Man, you related to, to the field, to life, it's, it's just everything, you know. And learning to trust the man beside you and trusting your leadership and, and your coaches. Just get out here and you, you do your best. You try to give your team everything you have, you know what I mean? So it's, it's about not letting one another down and, and also finding core values in your team that's going to help you thrive throughout your season of adversity. Go, Dad!